how many times have you been to Mexico? In my entire life, uh, I'd say I remember coming here when I was about 10. My mom, I think, brought me to visit my grandma for like a week. You know, she pulled me out of school. And uh, I really don't know how we got back. I think my school ID was what got me through. But, you know, back then it was a whole different thing. And uh, this is, besides that time when I was 10, like I, this is the first time I've been here. And that I've actually had to be here, stuck here, you know. Like, I got into a little scuffle with a friend of mine. They ended up taking me to the Tempe police station, and then they just immediately turned me over to the deportation because I didn't have a social, and they couldn't pull up a name on me or anything. So they brought me down here. They gave me one of two options, and one of them was either I could face a judge and try to state my case, you know, and try to tell them, well, I've been here 18 years. Um, I don't know nothing about Mexico. I don't know anything down there. I, I mean, my family down there. I don't know where they live. I don't you know, have any money. Yeah, how can you deport me? I, I could have done that, but they told me, you know, if you do that and the judge still denies you, it'll be even worse because then you'll be deported. You know, I came here voluntarily. I signed a voluntary leave. I mean, I told my mom earlier. She said, you know, I can get you, I can get you across the border again. I can get you this. You know, I we can set something up for you to to cross. You know, and I mean, I really don't. I don't want to do that, you know, because for one, it'll mess up my situation. I, mean, I don't even know how I can get into the school system or anything over here, you know, seeing as how I have no proof of where I've been for the past 18 years, you know. And uh, even if I do try to apply for a work visa or something, I don't know how that's going to go. I mean, I never really felt illegal, you know, I always, I felt like I was just another teenage, you know, American, because that's how I was raised, but. I just recently found out that's not how it is at all. And this is, I guess, this is where I belong, right? According to them.